To get started, I just added a video clip to my timeline that I'd like to change the color of Let's Begin by creating a new adjustment layer by right-clicking in the project panel and going to New Item Adjustment Layer. Then drag your adjustment layer above your video clip on the timeline. Next, go over to the Effects panel and type Tint into the search box. Do like the tint effect onto your adjustment layer on the timeline. Make sure your adjustment layer is selected and then go up to Effect Controls. If you only want to change your video to a single color, changing the map white to will usually look the best. Reduce the amount of detail if you want a more subtle effect. If you want a different lighter looking effect, change the map weight to back the way and change matte black to a different color. To create a multicolor blended tint, just change both colors. Now this looks good, but the reason I added the adjustment layer earlier is because it allows you to change the opacity's blend mode for your tint. This way you can create interesting blended color effects if that's what you're going for. Finally, if you want to animate your tint in and out start by moving the time head to where you want to begin showing your tint. Click the stopwatch next to amount to 10 to create a certain keyframe. Change the amount to 10 to 0. Then move the timeline to where you want your tint to be fully shown by increase the 10 to the amount of your choice to create a second keyframe. Then move the timer to where you want your tint to be removed by and change the amount of tip back to zero to create a third keyframe. Okay, now my tint goes in and out. All right, and that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you next time.